time to review Astro Boy. I mean, uh, Mega Man. No way to Circuit Breaker. All right, so the reason I picked it up is because it's a number one, three dollars, and the cover looks sexy as fuck. You know, like that pink hair and all that. And I saw a picture online. <laughs> what? Well, I saw a picture online that showed her. The reason I said Astro Boy at the beginning was because I saw a picture of her that showed a gun coming at her ass. <laughs> Which is a, 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 apparently the issue number two cover. So, you know, I read this whole thing already. So, I got the vibe of Astro Boy and hell, even Mega Man. You know, and I never really cared for Astro Boy. Mega Man's cool, I guess. But, you know, it's, it's an anime style book. It's set in a world where, you know, robots were created to pretty much make our lives easier. Which they did. And they did our wars for us and all that. And look, doesn't that look like Astro Boy a little bit? <laughs> I mean, come on. And, you know, basically they were set to fight our wars. You know, that's our main girl right there. Doesn't look much like that, but I don't know. But they, they pretty much hate robots now. Because they're like, they took our jobs and they destroyed the planet. And there's only a couple of us left in the world. And this is technically Japan, right? So, a lot like Astro Boy, <laughs> but no one calls it Japan. It's just a new, a new West. And look, he's, he's all happy. He's like, I'm selling stuff. Buy my stuff. They're all like, fuck you. <laughs> like, damn, look at all. All so sad. And the gas, you know, that releases from it starts killing everybody. Except for her, because she's a robot too. And he fucking flies. Also, I think he's, there's a lot of Japanese talk here. So hopefully I can learn Japanese by reading this book. You know, he says something over there along the lines of, he's sorry, because she says, you're sorry. He said, sumimasen? <laughs> I don't know Japanese, guys. But sumimasen? And he keeps saying that all the way down. And then we come to this guy who's slaughtering people in the streets. You know, he used to be in the war. He fought, he fought in the war alongside humans, you know, and all that. But now, you know, he just kills people because... You know, they pretty much hate robots. And this is basically a racism thing going on here. But, you know, she does her thing. Fighting them off. Takes them on. Her friend finds out about it. She's like, fuck you, bitch. I'm out of here. Let the cops handle you. And the the, the art is so weird. <laughs> it's so, but it's weird good, you know. It's kind of like... I don't know. It's like... Like a kid drew it, but it's still very good, very enticing. You know? It's like I don't know. The art look, the, the art. I don't know. The art looks real good for some reason, even though it looks like not like the other ones. You know, this is more like a realistic, right? This is more like a you know TV show on a budget, and this is like. Some deviant art stuff, but you know you got your Dr. Wiley and all that. That's why I say Astro Boy because she's basically a robot, built to take on the robots, protect the human beings from themselves. And basically, robots got sentient. You know they became sentient, and they're like, "Fuck this shit. We don't work for you. We run shit now." But there's still plenty of more humans than robots. And they're looking to rebuild. They're looking to conquer. Take over. And right now, as far as we know, she's basically the only one that can stop them. You know, and it's, it's, it's a real good book. It's a real long read. It's, it's pretty good, you know. Maybe it's got one or two. You know, Huck's awesome. But, you know, I haven't read Black Magic. But, yeah. And... Maybe that issue three or a variant, you know, show some, show some art here. I, I can't even draw like that. I mean, shit. I'm trying to write a comic book for crying out loud. And this is one hell of a book. I, I would say pick it up. Pick it up. If you want something new, fresh? This is very fresh, even though it, it's kind of the same old Astro Boy Mega Man story. You know, one robot against other robots protecting the people. 
anime style from Japan. <laughs> so, yeah. I've basically seen it all before, but this is definitely different in its own way. And I don't know, it's very nice. Just look at this. Even though the art plays around with itself, it's still a good looking book. And I would definitely recommend it. And I give it a 4 out of 5. 4 out of 5 because, you know, just there's too much, you know, it's too much connected. It's too connected to Astro Boy and Mega Man. You know, so it's, it's essentially the same thing. I mean, a gun comes out of her ass just like Astro Boy. Who else has a gun out the ass? Nobody. Well, it was just Astro Boy, but now it's her too, so boom. There's that. And that's. It's okay. It doesn't bother me too much, but it's enough to fault it one. But it's awesome. It's definitely awesome. Four out of five, awesome. So check it out. Alright? Circuit Breaker, Image Comics. Get it before it runs out. Later.